<laughs> Y'all! <when> I, <laughs> I was ready to give it all. If I can, if I can, if I can, if I can, if I can have you, nobody can. If you saw what the skank done to the man, you wouldn't look at me, you go look your friend. Black boy come like a dark raider. Girl, they looking like a tomb raider. Call my guy, tell him do me one favor. Leave the ends, come back a month later. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm the Nigerian Queen, live and direct from the University of North Texas. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. For those who don't know me, my name is Omolara, Lara for short. Today I'm going to be telling you guys a story time on how I stole my friend's prom date. I'm going to give you guys details on this hair. This hair is from Yuru Hair Company. I dyed it. Turned it into a wig, styled it all by myself. Um, laid by Lara, of course, which is my hair company with my hair business. Um, yeah, it's called Yuruk Hair Company. Honestly, it's amazing. Like, I put this hair through a lot. I'm gonna tell you guys, I didn't really put it through a lot, but it went through a process for it to still be looking like shiny and beautiful like this. And I couldn't even, I got four bundles in a closure and I couldn't even fit like the fourth bundle in, like, cause the bundles were so big, like, but that's the tea on this hair. Just let's calm down real quick. Let's not forget that this was back in high school, so like, don't judge me of what I'm about to tell you guys. Like, I am a whole new different person. I promise you. I I can't promise that. Like, high school Laura is in high school. This is like a newborn, like you know, third year in college. Like, uh, uh. anyways, so. Um, I'm not gonna say her name. It's uh, one of my friends, one of my really good friends. We're still friends with today. Um, so let me give you guys a background story. So we we had a prom group, right? You know, like in high school, you have like prom groups. So like, like it's, it's like a, I don't know how big. Like my prom group was huge. Like I think it was like ten, not huge. But it was like twelve to fifteen people, I think. Like, yeah, like 12 to 15. No, like 12 to 14, let's say, because, like, you need, like, boy, girl, boy, girl. We were planning, like, the whole prom thing, party buses, dates, trying to get right in order. I already had my day, um, you know. Everyone else was, like, you know, naming their dates. And, like, the way my school worked, like, you could go to prom with anyone, like, anyone, anywhere. So, like, my friend, uh, we're going to call her Becky. We're going to call her Becky. My, we're going to call my friend Becky. We're going to call the guy Prince. So... Becky was telling me about this, like she was just talking about her prom date. Oh, his name is Prince. This is that. I'm like, oh, I don't know. I don't know this nigga. So I was like, whatever, shot. So one day she showed a picture of him. I'm like, okay, hold on. This nigga kind of cute. Like, I was thinking, I was like, this nigga kind of cute. Like, mmm, he cute. Anyways, but my, it's not her boyfriend or anything. Not that I know. But it, I don't think it was her boyfriend. It was just a prom date. I think. Let me call her and check, cause she's not here to verify this information. Pierce yeah. was just your prom date, right? He wasn't like your boyfriend or anything, right? No, 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 he's just my prom date. Okay, I just wanted to verify, cause I wasn't sure. Are you uh, filming right now? Yes. All right, people, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Um, I was in the past. You still are. Cause there's no doubt, especially with this brand new wig you concocted, that if you and I were walking the room and my nigga was there, he would say hi to you first. <laughs> and at this point, <laughs> I can't keep living like this. What? <laughs> I'm trying to make a story time. You are not serious at all. Bye. I will call you back. Anyways, so I was just looking at her, I was like, damn, this nigga kind of cute. So I was like, okay, Lily, like, does this nigga got a girlfriend? Like, what? Like, what's going on with this nigga? But, like, I forgot. I don't even, I don't think he had a girlfriend. He didn't really have nothing going on back then. So, you know, I kind of forgot about him. Like, you know, so prom day rolls around. So we're supposed to take pictures, like, before prom, right? But, of course, like, I couldn't make it because I just never make anything. I couldn't take prom pictures, so they were there for like three hours and my, I was still trying to do my makeup and Mac. I get to the party bus, right? I finally get to the party bus. I'm still in a rush, like we get to the party bus and I'm still rushing, like still everywhere. My prom day is there, everyone's prom day is there. And I'm just like, oh yeah, we all look good. So I see this fine ass nigga, this, let me describe how this nigga look. Okay, Prince, this is what he looks like. He's like, what is he, Puerto Rican, Dominican? What is he, Lily? He's, he's mixed. He's 
Mexican and black. Okay, so this nigga is Mexican and black, right? So like, imagine like a like that mixture with like curly hair. <laughs> yeah. Y'all, <laughs> I was ready to give it all. Did he have his hair down? And he had a ponytail. I think he had his hair down. So it was just like nice and curly and like has so much volume and he was just was just speaking to me. And he turned around and I see this fine ass light skin ass nigga. I was, and that was back then when like light skin niggas was still popping like a little bit like till they went extinct. I was just like yeah like Chris Brown like this nigga is fine like yes like this is prom date or not whether I came with a prom date I didn't care like. So we get in a party bus. I'm just looking at this nigga from the corner like mind you we're all sitting with like our dates or whatever. So I'm, oh shit, I forgot all about my day. I was looking at that nigga like, so we're going to prom, you know, we just, you know, everyone's being a little shy. We didn't loosen up yet. So we're just on the party bus, just listening to music, whatever, yada, yada, yada. So we get to prom, you know, we take pictures, do, do what you normally, what do you do at prom? Take pictures, dance, eat. So we on the way back to the party bus, we was just like, I was just like, bitch, like, I need to conquer this nigga, like, for sure, for sure. So we're, first of all, we're just going, I don't know what that we're going to, I, I think we're going to, like, I think the part, I don't know where the hell we're going to, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. So, we're just going, first of all, like, it was kind of a little, it was intense, but like, everyone's still kind of like, tightened up. So we asked this guy, like, play music, or I think we played music, I'm not sure, somebody played music. Or somebody got on the ox, that's what it was, it was the ox in the back of the party bus. So when I got on the odds, you know, music is playing, then they get to twerk music, right? So we're on the highway, then... That first of all, the bus driver was driving wild. I don't even know what that nigga was driving because we couldn't even see. So we got on the highway and we're just driving. He's driving. The bus driver is driving, and I'm just like, bro, fuck this shit. Like, fuck a, fuck a prom day. Like, your girl. Anyway, so twerk music comes on, and I see this nigga. I'm just like, bro, let me give you this work. Like. <laughs> Let me bless your life, like let me let me do new, let me do a new thing in your life. So I just walked over there. I was like, let me get this nigga a roll up, like. So I rolled him up. If you guys don't know what a roll up is, it's like when you dance on a guy, like when you twerk on him. So I was like, bro, if I get like prom dress or not, like poofy dress or not, you finna get this work. So I get there, I started giving the nigga a roll up, started going in, yada yada yada. And honestly. It kind of, like, I just don't know. It escaped my mind that, like, he came with somebody and the person was my friend. Like, it's just like, I, I don't know what happened. Like, something obviously got into me. And it was... I saw... I saw... remember that anyway so I guess I th honestly I'm telling you guys like you know when you get tunnel vision like you know what you want like I never knew what I wanted so much in my life I knew I wanted that nigga though I knew I wanted that nigga I didn't see nothing but him like I didn't see my prom day I didn't see my friend sitting next to him so I walked up in and gave that nigga a roll up like I gave him that work and yes when I tell you guys I put it down it was worth it more than it was worth it so I gave him that work or whatever. Everybody looking at me all confused, like, uh, and I just like then, uh, like, I was just like, like we graduating, so like, who, which one of y'all gonna be my? <laughs> Nobody, okay. And he wasn't complaining, so I was like, I mean, Shay, if he not complaining, then you you can't complain because he he's not complaining. Once again, I'm a changed person. I would never never do that again. <laughs> You're lying. I promise, like, I'm a change. It was high school, like. You guys don't understand, like, I could tell so many stories about wild high school Lara, but I'm a changed person now. That was literally old Lara. This is a new reborn Lara. So, you don't gotta worry about that, but I mean, if your man's come for me, I, I can't, I can't, can't, just kidding, just kidding. Thanks for listening to my story time. I know it was short, it was quick, it was something, just quick and short that I just, oh my god, there's hair in my face. It was something... <laughs> something quick that just popped up in my head if you enjoyed this video make sure you give it a thumbs up make sure you like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys later girl i didn't finesse you he, no, he. i'm still heartbroken bye i'm still heartbroken that was a fine ass nigga that could have been the love of my life but no you didn't care did you <laughs> what that's tech that's all you do, you take, you took pits, 
Yeah. I caught him print right. on YouTube. I caught him print on YouTube. Some parents while your date sat there and watched you take. That's what killed me about the whole thing. I would go into a date. He's just sitting there shaking his head like, bro, what did I get myself into? Exactly, sir. Me too. Me too. Chains, Honestly, truly. Chains liar. It's a chains liar. And I'm a new person. I promise. I was so hurt. Lord, the man snatching. That's how you got your title. Y'all's fine. You snatching, man? That's okay. I've changed. I've changed. Y'all I don't snatch nobody's nigga. <laughs> don't you see her talk lady, bro? This man was minding his business. Waka Flocka came on. And all oh, it was Waka Flocka. I give him the word to Waka Flocka. You're actually not shit. <laughs> I'm not Bro, she recorded it. You guys don't want to see yeah. it. Oh yeah, my gosh. I'm mad. I'm sad. I'm upset. Don't know how we're still friends, but that's okay. It's in the past. A new year, new Lara. Girl, you've been saying that for six years now. Bye. <laughs> Shout out my mucus. Hey, hey. Can you know that be my slime?